Yo, what is going on guys? Dr. Lula back here today. This is kind of a wow. Oh, it's kind of a weird way to start this off, but I recently uh, not recently, but a week ago I've joined a faction. Not a faction, sorry. It's a server called Molten. Pretty much a lot of YouTubers are playing it out right now. And I bought a VIP in it because I had that extra cash. So I decided to start playing in it. Um a lot of been stuff has been going on though. Obviously I have not recorded a single episode yet, but as you see, uh Pretty much in the server, I, I, I would exit out of it right now, but there's limited spots as you can tell. Right now, there's too many people in the server, so if I get out, somebody's gonna take my spot and I won't be able to get back in the server. So anyways, so, I was in a faction with my friend and a few other guys. My friend is in my Spanish class, so, so obviously I know him. And pretty much how this server works is it has vaults, so as you see, these are all my items, all right? If you ever watched Lachlan or Vicstar, they play on the same server, obviously that's why everybody's playing on it. So I have all of these runes which can pretty much be used to put on uh, weapons and such. All of these, and then we have two diamonds and we have a rift token which can be used to buy other stuff as well. Then we have a bunch of ender pearls that we could as well sell. We have a bunch of potions, an axe, this axe is pretty bad but I don't know why. Then a compass, then I have, a mo I have money, I, this is pretty much like my bank account, I have $50,000 right over here. And then we got two more, and then we have more of those. And then we have like a bunch of random stuff. Pretty much the main objective of this game is to get enough. Is it? I, I don't even. I don't even understand. Just like to get like the best faction in the game, I guess. But uh, as you see, I'm really hungry because I haven't eaten. Because I will show you on a few minutes. So then we go to Vault Two, and we have all this random stuff everywhere. If I ever need armor, I really need to fix all these. But I have all these cool bows. Like this one's really alive. And then uh yeah. We can sell a lot of that stuff as well. And we go to Vault 3. This is my final vault. We have a Blaze Spawner in here as well. And then we have a bunch of random stuff as well. This is a pretty... Look at that. That's pretty nice. Now, I want to tell you why I am hungry. Is First of all, this is my, my, my home. I'm able to have two houses. And not including the faction house. And my faction house has just got raided again. It got raided the first time they took my sword that had like five enchantments on it that I did get. So, um, it's very complicated how I did get it. Uh, you go to the spawn and then you jump down to call the war zone. Every 20 minutes, the chest will restock and you pretty much more loot will come. So, if you die, then oh well, then you're trash. You lose all your stuff and you need to restart. But, anyways, so my faction house just got, uh, it got, uh, looted for the looted. Yeah, I got looted for the second time. First time, like I said, they just took my sword. This time, they actually looted the whole thing. We had a bunch of monster spawners. We're pretty much set. Now, I'm kind of am regretting that I, I quick so not I sold all of them with, with my hand. I sold all the the steak and stuff with my hand because now I don't have food supply. This is the only food supply I do have. So, um, I guess I guess I'll just mine these up. I'll actually do it afterwards just so I can show you. So, if we go to my uh, actually, I, I I'm not in even in a faction. My friend disbanded the whole faction. So I'll, I set it as my home house, and this is my home home. So I'll show you now, and I don't want to join. I'm recording. So this is my this this is the uh, faction that we did have. It was a really nice building, but it was in a horrible location. Look at it. Oh my gosh. For the f video, I don't even know. All right, so. Uh, as you see, this water was all the way down there. I told him to make it higher. He said, no, that would be a dumb idea. So I'm like, okay, whatever. And we got raided. We had a bunch of cow spawners and pig spawners over here. It's pretty sad when I walked into the server and it was uh, all looted. Because it was a really nice building. And then we have our ender chest that we had stuff in. Okay, do F, plebs, plebs stun. All right. All right. Okay. I will do it now, but don't bother. All right, so we have all this stuff. This is a fire aspect, two obsidian sword uh, hoe. We got this from the chest as well. All this stuff is pretty much from the chest, besides these block of quartz. This is an insane rune. Uh, that rune can go for like 15k, I'm pretty sure. We got that lucky sword, which is pretty cash as well. We got that. This is trash. We don't know why we have that. But uh, so yeah, we have no food right now because we had a massive supply of cow spawners, but they're expensive. To go to my balance, we have $31,000. So. Um, yeah, I get, okay, Plebstone's not even an option. Alright, doesn't matter. Anyways, so, um, 
Yeah, we don't have a lot of money, actually. If we go, there's a slash auction house. Can I kill you for clue? Oh, shoot. I just pulled up. Sure. Invite me. <laughs> oh, my gosh. And uh, as I was about to say, there's something called a clue in this thing that you do a clue and then you get, like, some cash stuff. Like, this guy's clue is to craft 10 cakes. He's trying to sell it because it's physically impossible to craft those 10 cakes. It's so rare to get eggs. It's a big problem. So, if you get... If you get like any spawner or anything, you're pretty much stacked. If you get a blaze spawner, you're 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 set. You have so much money, it's impossible. But uh, th this is pretty much like the auction house. People are just auctioning every day. As you see, this guy's yeah, he's going. This one's going for 10k and has a 99% success rate, which is pretty high. That's why it's going for so much. But uh, see, this is my random trash. My friend gave it to me, the guy that I was just texting as well. Okay, TP accept. Actually, he's gonna kill me. So he has a clue. So I might as well. I'll help a fine gentleman in need. Just throw all this stuff in here. Wait, let me take my stuff off. And what the heck, where is he? I don't know. All right, anyways, where is he? Uh, it's good for me anyways, because I do need... Where, where is he? Oh, there he is. I need him to kill me anyways, because I don't have any health, so it's mine as well. Thank you. Appreciate that dearly. This is the main spawn. As I'm here, I will show you the war zone on just what it what the war zone actually is so pretty much just the spawn for the humans and um it's uh i don't know it's just a normal spawn so what you do you would go down here every 20 minutes uh you jump down here you take no fall damage when you go in here you don't take fall damage from the war zone but when you come over here there will be chests everywhere that uh every 20 minutes every 20 to 23 minutes there will be the chest will restock and they will have pretty insane stuff in there that will be very useful later. And he wants me to TP to him, but I'll just see if these chests are full. I know where a few of them are. There's two over here. There's one right there. We'll see when the last time this was looted to see one to come back. It was looted 11 minutes ago, so there's more chests around the whole area. All the chests stay in the same spot. So actually, if I, I could set my house right here. And then every time it says new loot will be coming, I just set it there. I guess if that works. But um, yeah, so right now here's my friend. I don't know where he's going anyways, but he told me to join his faction, but I'm not in it yet, so... Okay, I'm just following him, I guess. I don't know. Oh, he's right next to the war zone. What? Oh, oh, okay. I guess he needs to kill me for that clue again. Or something. I don't even know. Okay, so he's, he's ass. Anyways, so, um... So, yeah, that's pretty much what's happening now and what's going to be happening on this series, I suppose, I guess. I mean, there's not really much to say, but, um... Actually, my... Let's see, my faction home is pretty destroyed, so I will actually see if I'm able to set my house at one of my uh, set homes over here at that chest that I was just at, because there's a few other chests in the area. If I'm able to do that, that'd be pretty cool, because every time I would say there's new loot that will be arriving shortly, I can just do that. And uh, actually, I don't know. They, I don't know. They might let me do that. I, I don't know. I'll, I'll try it. I mean, there, I have no need for that second house anyways, because that thing is raided. And there's nothing left in it, sadly. So, I will actually see. I doubt it will let me because I'll be cheating. But, oh, I'm on fire. F, no. Slash set home house. Oh, okay. It let me do it. I was actually surprised it let me do that, honestly. Because I think that's cheating. So, anyways, I'll show you other areas. Over. Oh, my gosh. I'm on fire. This is the area I always go to. Anyway, you see there's a chest right here as well. That will also have the same amount of stuff in it. It's uh, obviously the, all the stuff is randomized, obviously, because we're not going to put the same stuff in every chest. So I will actually go explore right now to see where other chest is in this location. Oh, yeah, right over here. There's three chests over here. There's one chest down there, another chest right there, and then another chest all the way on the other side. But if it actually does let me set that as my home location, which it did, I'm wondering if it would actually let me do it or like call like cheats or something. I set it as that location right there, so... Whatever I do, every time it says, like, there's something coming, I grab that chest, I run across here, grab this chest, then I'll jump down over here, like this, I'll show you now. Because I, I do want to actually kill myself just so I can show you. So what you'll do, you run down here and grab this chest, and then you run over here and grab this chest, which was also empty, I just checked. And you run over here, and then you try to do parkour. If you had armor, it would be much easier because you take less health stuff and i have i think i have a few golden apples so i can use the golden apples so if i go home house i'm one okay i'm in combat sorry uh you you can't teleport another 15 seconds after you die 
so that's a problem but uh, also there's a command called slash back if you do die then you can just uh, do that command but I want to see home house that's what it's called house my home home is my home that I was in before so let's actually see where it takes us will it work will it work it, it actually works fantastic that's actually cool I should have thought of that before on the, in the chat every hour it says that new loot will be available so I can just set like I can just quickly do that button run over here grab that grab the chest behind there jump down there jump down there set it all in my vault now the thing is this vault uh, the people cannot take stuff out of your vault even if they kill you so it's pretty fantastic it's pretty much like a, a portable chest that cannot be like destroyed or anything taken out but the thing is you cannot use your vault while in combat obviously so uh, I'm wondering how long this video was now that's pretty much just like a, a main that's a that's a whole cap about what this is gonna be about so um, I'm really excited to join this new clan clan this is this new faction started my channel once again after I said I will a while ago but uh, I, have, I have big plans for this actually honestly but that has not been happening because I am working on getting my license permit if you did see when I did that so anyways guys uh, thank you guys for watching if you did enjoy this video and you want to support please hit that like button let's try to get I don't know let's say five likes I guess I don't even know but anyways um so yeah thank you